This is my typical Tuesday morning in Japan. And this is not my typical Tuesday morning in Japan. Guess which day this video is going to be about. My name is Anim, and I'm an American living in Japan for almost nine years. Want to know the best places to see Mount Fuji? <laughs> <laughs> First spot on our list is Fujiyama Twin Terrace near Kawaguchiko. Opened in 2021, this place has breathtaking views of Mount Fuji and I don't know if it was because it was a weekday, but literally no one else was there except for my group. Before coming to Japan, I never knew I could hate the wind so much. to be here at like 7.50. Look at my eyes, man, I look like shit. Ah. In order to get here, you will need to take a shuttle bus for just 200 yen or a little over one dollar. <laughs> Next, you'll have to do a short climb up a narrow path and then you can see this. <laughs> Next, 3,280 feet above sea level is the observation deck accessed by the Mount Fuji Panorama Ropeway in Kawaguchi, Yamanashi. When my mother was visiting Japan, my dear Japanese friend, who I call my Japanese grandmother, strongly insisted that we come here. So we all went together. You can get to the ropeway via a 15 minute ride on the omnibus red line and get off at Yuransen Ropeway Iriguchi bus stop. We got here early, apparently. Lunch isn't until like 30 minutes. 30 minutes! What are we gonna do till then? Ah, <laughs> iranai <laughs> Recently, I've been feeling very overwhelmed and decided to check my sponsorship emails to see what opportunities I could share with you guys. I stumbled upon this amazing opportunity to see Mount Fuji. But in order for me to take up this sponsorship opportunity, I had one major condition that almost got my invitation revoked. I asked not to be required to name drop the company. There's often a long wait to get onto the ropeway, but the views are spectacular and, in my opinion, worth it. While you can take the ropeway back down the mountain, there are also hiking trails down the peak or up to a small shrine with more views of Mount Fuji. Let me like try to fill you guys in on what's happening. To help alleviate some of the over-tourism happening around Mount Fuji, I was offered to go on a trip with a few other influencers to promote a new tourist space opening near the station. Guys, this is so strange right now. As you can see, everyone kind of like backed away to try to give the influencers some space. I have no idea what I'm doing. Little do they know. Next, voted as trip advisor's number three place to visit in Kawaguchiko is Oishi Park. This place is phenomenal for nature, local foods, the lake, and of course, probably the best place to view Mount Fuji. At this point, you may have noticed that all of the locations in this list are near Kawaguchiko. Kawaguchiko is Mount Fuji's most easily accessible lake from Tokyo. It's also the most developed. So if you're coming to Japan for just two weeks, it's your best bet for saving time and having a variety of activities to choose from, all within breathtaking views of Mount Fuji. This was the whole point of me waking up at 5 a.m. this morning to come here. <laughs> Apparently this place is supposed to be opening up tomorrow and this is like the 
reveal before the reveal. Look at that! <laughs> Look, we're here. That's Kamaguchi Station right there. And that's Mount Fuji right there. You know one thing that's so awkward about living in Japan? I just met a whole busload of different people. They all know my name, of course, because I'm the only foreigner. I keep forgetting everyone's name. Wow, cute. ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。いらっしゃいませ、どうぞ。ここはホテル<笑><笑><笑> ジャケット。ジャケット。ジャケット。ジャケット。ジャケット。ジャケット。ジャケット。ジャケット。ジャケット。ジャケット。ジャケット。ジャケット。ジャケット。ジャケット。ジャケット。ジャケット。ジャケ